Here we're going to mount the X-belt anchors and the Y-belt guide rollers to the main carriage. So for this you'll need the main carriage, that's the piece with the bearings mounted on it, the contents of bag number 5, that's the X-belt anchors plus the belt tensioner, and also the small spanner out of bag number 12, the tool bag. So, first of all, there's three different lengths of screw here, um, two 10mm screws, one 16mm and one 20 I'll refer to them as short, medium and long. So, first of all, take the medium screw and a washer and place it through the left anchor post hole on the carriage. Then put on uh, an anchor post with another washer and a nut to finish it off. Tighten that using the small end of the spanner and the posi drive number one screwdriver. So that's the left anchor post into place. Next we'll do the right anchor post. This is the tensioner plate. By moving it we can pull the belt tight. So we take the long screw, that's the 20mm one, a washer, put it through the tensioner plate. Then we need to put this spacer on, that's the large disc spacer. Then the anchor post, another washer, and a nut. And again, use the spanner and the posi drive number one screwdriver to tighten it. Place this assembly on top of the carriage. You can see there's two screw holes visible through the slots here. And then use the remaining two short screws to fasten it. Tighten the screws down, then back them off a turn. to allow the plate to move. We don't want to tighten this until the entire machine is assembled and we can check the belt tension. So now we're going to do the Y-belt guide rollers which are in bag 6. So take one of the screws Put on a washer first, put on a flanged bearing with the flange towards the head of the screw, then put on a plain bearing, another washer, and that's that assembled. Place that through the hole in the carriage plate. Turn it over and put a washer and nut on the back. Do the same for the other, it's absolutely identical. Screw, washer, flange bearing, plain bearing, another washer, through the carriage, a washer, and a nut. And again using the plastic spanner, tighten these using the posi drive number two screwdriver. First one.
and the second one. So these will allow the Y belt to snake round the motor pulley which is going to be in the middle there. Okay, we're finished.